Greetings Palo Alto Hills members. I'm Lauren Thompson and today I'll be sharing with you the April edition of Hillside Highlights. Now there's so much to look forward to this month, but before we get started, I'd like to welcome our new members in the ticker below. Everyone welcome to the PAH family. Now spring is upon us and that means Easter is just around the corner and rumor has it that the Easter Bunny is hopping through the hills. So should you. Join us for our annual Easter brunch where we will celebrate in style with a buffet fit for Peter Rabbit and Mr. McGregor. Sunday, April 17th is a day for the entire family and we can't wait to share the holiday with all of you. Be sure to register early though so you don't miss the Easter Bunny and the egg hunt. And don't be surprised if the Easter Bunny hides eggs in the new orchard. Last month, Chef Brian's three-year dream and planning for the on-site orchard was finally realized with the help of Superintendent Andrew Morgan and his team. In fact, the team planted over 125 fruit trees in the new orchard to the left of holes 7 and 8. Go check it out for yourself. Now, speaking of the hardworking team at Palo Alto Hills, let's hear from Tall Tree Foundation board members Matt and Lori about the newly formed charitable foundation to support staff in times of need. Nice to see you. Yeah, you too. Hey, question. Uh, I was wanting to do something for our staff here at Palo Alto Hills, and I was wondering, is there a mechanism uh, that members could take advantage of uh, to help support uh, our wonderful staff? Yeah, have you heard about the Tall Trees Foundation? Tall Trees Foundation, uh, yes. I remember seeing something uh, to coincide with the opening of the front nine, oh. uh, but tell me more. I, I didn't get a lot of context then. Yeah, so the Tall Trees Foundation is a new nonprofit organization that is funded um, completely by generous member donations. And all of these donations are in support of the employees who experience financial hardships. Wow, that sounds perfect. Uh, is this affiliated through the club directly, or this is a separate organization, separate entity? Uh, it's a completely separate entity. It has its own articles, it has its own bylaws, and its own board of directors that govern the foundation. How cool. Yeah. And so are they also responsible for the uh, holiday fund? I know uh, around you know fall, we get uh, communications about participating in the holiday fund. Is this different? Yeah, this is totally different. As I mentioned before, the foundation is um, solely based on supporting uh, the employees at Palo Alto Hills when they experience unexpected financial um, hardships. Oh, that's great. Um, and is there somewhere that I can find out more information? I'd be keen to donate. I mean, this sounds... Uh, exactly what I was looking for. Yeah, that's great. Again, you know, the foundation really relies on member donations. Um, so you can go to their website, which is um, talltreesfoundation.org to make your uh, tax deductible donation. I'm really excited. I'm gonna check out the website. Awesome. Uh, I knew you'd have the information and I'm excited to participate and donate to the Tall Trees Foundation. That's great. Thanks, Lori. Thanks, Matt. Thank you, Matt and Lori. Now, swinging into April, a new spring golf mixer is coming to the hills, and it will be hosted by our very own head golf professional, Anthony Maestrini. So this co-ed member event will be an individual stable for a tournament focusing on fun while mingling with other members on the golf course. The tee box is where the fun starts, but we finish strong with appetizers and drinks after the last ball drops on nine. For more information or any questions that you have for upcoming tournaments or invitationals, click over to the golf page on the website. And now moving on to the fitness arena. Our teen spring fitness training is coming to the hills and hosted by lead fitness supervisor, Tony Jones. This will be a great way for your teen to start exercising or stay in shape for their sports season. We invite them to try something new while making friends in the process. Sessions run from Wednesday, April 6th through Friday, April 8th. Contact our wellness desk for more information on these events. And that brings us to the end of this edition of Hillside Highlights. April has much to offer, but you just wait until May rolls around. Until then, I'm Lauren Thompson. Thanks for watching.